Weather Rate Certified Most Accurate Forecast in Central Texas. This is Fox 44 Weather with Chief Meteorologist Mike LaPointe. We made it to Friday. A lot of sunshine, a few clouds out there right now. Temperatures today climbing into the lower 100s. If you are headed out this Friday night, maybe you're going to have dinner. Of course, you want to sit inside where it's much cooler or find a mist. Or if you are sitting outside, skies are partly cloudy. There's no rain across the region. This is in Woodway, our live Centex seamless scatter. Sky Tracker here in Woodway, that is Highway 84, looking pretty good. It is 97 degrees right now in Waco, 99 Temple, 97 in the Colleen area. And temperatures about the same as you work your way down toward Caldwell, 98, and maybe a tad cooler, but it's more humid in College Station in 93 degrees. There's that heat index at 98, 102 in Hearn, 103 degrees here in Temple, and Hillsboro has a heat index of 101 degrees. As we track the tropics, we've got a little disturbance right now that the uh, National Hurricane Center is keeping an eye on. That is where the X marks the spot. So that's what they're watching right now. A little tropical uh, thunder going on with that right now. But over the next five days, it's expected to drift to the south and the west only giving it a 10% chance of any tropical developing um, development occurring within the next five days. But we're hoping maybe a little moisture and some cloud cover could be sent up our way. We will see if that happens right now. I think it may be just a little bit too far to the south. But again, uh, it's starting to uh, act up just a little bit here across the region. Right now on our future cast, as we head out this evening, again, partly cloudy skies. Temperatures will slowly fall back down into the 80s by midnight. There's the front to our north. Front just kind of meanders down our way here. And uh, by 7 o'clock in the morning, we'll be waking up to mid to upper 70s tomorrow with a few clouds around. And then again, a mix of sun and clouds. Noontime temperatures right around 90, 92 degrees. And then by the afternoon, we'll try to spark off a, a shower, but few and far between. High temperatures tomorrow, I'd say upper 90s to lower 100s across the region. And we kind of do it all over again very late Saturday into Sunday here across the region. That front is not going to affect us whatsoever. So Sunday, we'll start off temperatures mid 70s. And then as we go throughout the day, mostly sunny skies. Once again, temperatures climbing into the upper 90s and lower 100s here across the region. But I wanted to show you this. Take a look. This is uh, from the Climate Prediction Center. This is the 8 to 14 day outlook. Now the next week or two, we're taking a, a peek out. Again, this changes uh, very frequently, as you know, but it has temperatures cooler than average. Average highs are in the mid to upper 90s. So we will see what happens here over the next couple of weeks. And look at this too. Our rain chances are above normal, at least here over the next week or so. So we just keep your fingers crossed so we get some development down to the south of us and then you can send some tropical moisture up our way. But that's how it looks right now, which is better than seeing a lot of red and dry conditions on top of us. That is for sure. Partly cloudy skies tonight, 77 degrees will be the low temperature. And then 101 tomorrow, there's that 20% chance of an isolated shower. More sunshine, I think, on Sunday. Again, 101 degrees will be the high temperature. And then as we look ahead, this is the family RV long range 10 day forecast. 102 on Monday, 103 on Tuesday, 104 on Wednesday and you notice our chances of rain actually will start to go up a little bit and temperatures will go down a little bit. So not looking bad, at least right now for the tail end of next week. We're looking at temperatures pretty seasonal with those rain chances. Nighttime lows will be in the 70s and then down toward Bryan and College Station. 30% chance tomorrow, mainly because of the sea breeze. Otherwise, upper 90s around 100 on Monday and next week. Up and down, upper 90s, lower 100s. Again, best chances of rain will be Thursday and Friday, and maybe a pattern change there by next weekend with a little bit cooler weather. Okay. Well